It's interesting that when one goes to tune your stringed instrument, uh, it's always interesting which way you have to tune it. Sometimes the strings have obviously lengthened for some reason, and so you're having to tune it up. Or often it's they've tightened up and you have to loosen them. And almost always the, uh, the B string needs uh, tuning. The other strings are more likely to be in tune. But. So I don't know who did this song, but it has, it's sort of, um, I think of the Bakersfield Jazz or, um, oh, I can't think of their name. Oh, uh, Bob Wills, uh, the Texas Playboys. They did sort of a jazz country style, so, and this is one of the songs. Pardon me, boy, is this a chance to get you to? Country Jazz. And here is the aforementioned uh, song uh, by John Prine. Uh, in another video, I called him the singing cowboy. That was someone else. That was Gene Autry. This is a singing postman because he kept his postal route for many, many years. His recordings of songs were often not super popular, you know, people who were musicians treasured his work, but it wasn't, uh, it's not like he made a lot of money. A lot of people covered his songs, and he did get royalties there, but uh, that took a while, so. Yeah, very uh, self-effacing guy. It's kind of an odd term, self-effacing. Is there some kind of facing where other people efface you? <laughs> Oh, questions, questions. We had a partner. You know that old season 
one with my fingers, which is kind of a purest form of music playing, I guess, because all you're using is your fingers, no pick, just strings in a box. Oh, straighten myself up here. Okay. Well, I'll be damned, here comes your voice again, but that's not unusual, it's just that the moon is full, and you have to Yes, a girl on the house shelf would keep you 
I've got up the white clouds and leaves.